silence on your Roku TV while everything else seems fine. Audio issues like these are more common than you'd think, and often easier to fix than they appear. In this video, I'll show you exactly how to troubleshoot and fix no sound problems on your Roku. Let's start by restarting your Roku, because a simple reboot can often fix sound problems. First, try a soft restart. Press the home button on your remote, then go to settings. From there, scroll down to system, then go to power, and select system restart. Your TV will turn off and power back on. If that doesn't work, we'll try a hard restart using a special remote shortcut. With your Roku turned on, grab your remote and press the home button five times. Then press the up arrow once, rewind twice, and fast forward twice. After a few seconds, your Roku will freeze for a moment and then begin restarting. Let it fully reboot and once it's back on, check if the sound is working. Now unplug your Roku TV from the power outlet while it's still on. Just pull the plug straight out. Wait for about 30 seconds, don't rush this part, then plug it back in and turn the TV back on. Once it's powered up again, check if the sound has come back. Next, go into your Roku settings and check the audio setup. Press the home button on your remote, scroll down to settings, then go to audio. First, look for the option that says TV speakers and make sure it's turned on. If it's off, the built-in speakers won't work. Then go to audio mode and try switching between auto, stereo, and PCM. Test each one to see if the sound comes back. After that, scroll to digital output format and change it. If it's on auto, try switching to Dolby Digital or PCM and see which one makes the audio work again. If nothing has worked so far, you can try resetting the audio and picture settings. Press the home button, go to settings, scroll to system, then to advanced system settings. From there, choose factory reset and then select the option that says reset TV audio picture settings. Follow the instructions on your screen to complete the reset. This won't delete your apps or personal data, it only resets sound and picture settings. Another thing you can do is check for a system update. Go to Settings, then System, and select System Update. Choose Check Now and let it search for any updates. If one is available, go ahead and install it. Sometimes updates fix audio issues caused by bugs. While you're watching something on your Roku, press the Star button on your remote to open the Options menu. Scroll to the Sound Settings and see if DTS Virtual X is turned on. If it is, turn it off. Then back out and check if the sound comes back. If your sound is missing only in one specific app, like Netflix or YouTube, the problem might be with the app itself. Try uninstalling the app, then reinstalling it from the Roku Channel Store. You can also check if the app has its own audio settings. Make sure the app is updated to the latest version, and then test the sound again. If you've tried everything and the sound still isn't working, you can do a full factory reset as a last resort. Go to Settings, then System, then Advanced System Settings, and choose Factory Reset. Select Factory Reset Everything and follow the instructions on your screen. Keep in mind this will erase all your installed apps and personal settings, so only do this if nothing else worked. That's it for this video on how to fix no sound on your Roku TV. I hope this step-by-step -step guide helped you get your audio working again. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more easy tech fixes. Got questions? Or did one of these steps work for you? Let me know in the comments. I'd really like to hear how it went. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.